Hello and welcome to an ANOVA system snippet video. My name's Sam Bromley and I'm going to show you how you can format your dimensions using the dimension flyout toolbar. So if we click on an individual dimension we've already got placed in our sheet here. If you keep your cursor nice and still what you will see on your screen is a little heads up display which is the dimension flyout toolbar. If you just hover over that you'll see some very similar options that you would find on the left hand side of the properties of the dimension. So what we can do here is we can format our dimension display in a particular way. So let's make some changes to this dimension. First off, I'm going to put a bilateral tolerance on it. Let's make that 0.01 and we have a minimum of 0.02. And as you can see, that updates automatically on the dimension itself. We can put a unit precision on here. Let's go for three decimal places. And we could also put some customizable text. So let's say TYP for typical. Okay, so I've formatted my, my dimension here to show in a particular way. Now what if I want to reuse all the changes that I've made to that dimension on a different dimension that I've got, say for this diameter that I have down here? Well, nice and simple. I click on the, click on the dimension again go to the dimension flyout toolbar and what you'll find on the right hand side here now is a star icon and styles that's our favorite styles so what you'll see if you click on that button is the most recent styling that you've applied to the dimension at the top we can simply click on that particular recently saved favorite and it will format that dimension with the very same settings so we've got three decimal places a bilateral tolerance and the typical text on there as well and you can do this to any other dimension that you've got so this process is quite similar to the format painter and it's a nice quick way of applying that particular format to your dimensions very quickly without having to fill it, fill it out every time so i hope this has been a useful snippet for you and thanks for watching